What is up guys this is Karan here welcome back to Tech Karan YouTube channel Bliss Room which is which was one of the most customizable room ever for Android devices It is now really the most customizable room ever because we have a lot of rooms available based on AOSP based on Pixel based on CAF a lot of rooms like Resurrection Remix, Havoc OS, that has a lot of customizations available. But still, Bliss Room has a lot of customizations or not. We are going to talk about that later on. Let me show you. This is Bliss Room 12.1 12.12 latest version, which I've installed on my Redmi Note 9 Pro, which is available for a lot of devices as official build and unofficial build. I'll try to include all the devices, and the link for all the devices is in the description. You can go and check it out. Let's find out which other things you get here guys i'm using this latest bliss version which is based on android version 10 with the september security patch the home screen will look like almost same the features and the things would always be same with all the versions all the devices which have the bliss room available only the device specific things might be different but other things will be same if the things from source Talking about the default, we have the launcher, launcher pre-installed. When you go to the home settings, you will see easily that this is a launcher which is pre-installed and launches a very cool customizable launcher if you compare it with the Pixel launcher. It's based on Pixel launcher, so has all the Pixel features including we have some other extra features, theme, desktop, home widget, dock, etc. And if you want to install these kind of cool looking wallpapers on a device, I'll put the link in the description for all the wallpapers. You can go and install them manually if you want to. I have more than 10 wallpapers. I think you can go and install them. We have the icon pack support, but by default, we'll see these kind of icons out there. As you can see, these are the icons you get there, which are kind of USB icons. I sometimes don't use them. I'm just using it from some time. Let me show you some two, three more things which we have right now here. First of all, we have the Bliss Papers app, which is actually the Bliss Wallpapers app out there in which you will get a lot of wallpapers. This is a very interesting thing, by the way, because like me, I always want some good wallpaper apps in my device because I want to change wallpapers regularly at some regular interval. So this app is available pre-installed. It's kind of really interesting thing and it has a lot of wallpapers. Whichever wallpaper you like, you can choose that one. You can download that one. You can apply directly from here. We have the minimal. We have the waiver, wrath. A lot of wallpapers are available here. If we talk about the quick settings, we have this quick setting header image option available in which I have chosen this option, this build, this pick, which looks interesting. We have another cool kind of header images available here. The quick settings panel look like this, which is almost same like other USB based rooms. But we have the brightness lighter here, which looks interesting. And other things, we have the carrier option available here too. The Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, mobile data, hotspot, etc. is perfectly fine here. If we want to enable the hotspot, the Wi-Fi and the hotspot enabling at the same time, which is a very interesting thing in my case. The tiles are a little bit of, I think, very dark looking, dark, dark blue color. But you can adjust easily by going into settings where we have a lot of things, options available. We're going to take a look at all these features one by one now. But let me show you one thing. If I uh, choose the latest Magisk version, which is Magisk V21.0, as you can see, I'm using the latest Magisk 21.0, which is available for Android 11 also. And here in my case, the safety net status is passed, which is a unbelievable thing and beautiful thing out there and i have not hide the magic manager yet and also this is redmi note 9 pro if you have any other device i'm not sure about the safety net but in my case the safety net is passed so yes this is a very interesting thing for me which i want to choose also if you talk about the device specific thing we have the Dolby Audio which is pre-installed. This is also kind of a device specific thing out there. Maybe this will not be available for all the devices. But for Redmi Note 9 Pro, it's available here. Other things are kind of same thing. We have the battery stats options available. These are the things universal if we talk about. And in Bliss Room, these options here, we don't have the blank space option available, which is interesting. We have direct these kind of things available here. Battery stats, we can reset if we want to. Battery capacity, battery temperature, these are the things you get here. Display have very cool kind of things, adaptive brightness, screen timeout and these kind of things as expected, nothing else, nothing new. Sound, storage, privacy, etc. Security has the face lock and app lock, both options available here. 
like the fingerprint and pattern almost same things right there we have the system google accessibility and these kind of things let's move to the blissify which has a lot of customizations this is a default panel where you have a lot of things out there which you want to choose you can simply choose this you can simply choose them if you want to choose status bar customizations quick settings customizations animations buttons lock screen gestures notification themes and more these are the things you get here we're going to directly go to the themes section where you have some themes options available this is kind of a styles and wallpaper where you can apply these styles i have tried to apply the style and my device was just stuck here and was not applying maybe this uh, this might be the device specific bug for me because this is an unofficial build for redmi note 9 pro maybe for you this might be the cool thing other things we have a lot of fonts options available which is a very interesting thing so if you want to choose these kind of fonts you can choose that which is looking interesting but i think that will need some restart of system ue or your device and these kind of things but as i already told you these things will only for device specific things quick settings animation buttons lock screen are uh, a lot of customizations you can go and try it out havoc os resurrection mix has better and more customizations than this room so you need to try out those also these are good these are enough but you can try out these kind of things if you want to these were the things i just wanted to share with you this was a brief review about bliss os latest custom room if you like it don't forget to like and share the installation is quite simple install the room and reboot or format data whatever else you want to do thanks for watching goodbye